The new Red Dead Online event for August is officially here, and with it comes the free outfit reward and discounts that we talked about earlier on the channel, but we also have the full list of monthly rewards and extra bonuses for fast gold, money, and XP. Whether you're a new player or a longtime vet of Red Dead Online, this update may have something in it for you, and although many players are not too enthused about it overall because they feel like it's too little too late, the bonuses and rewards and maybe even some of the discounts this time around are worth checking out if you're still playing, but in the meantime, let's discuss what there is to do this month, and let's get started with all the free rewards, items, and more. If you enjoy this video at any point, or if you just find it helpful, let me know by dropping a like on it. And if you want to stay up to date and in the loop with everything Red Dead Redemption 2 and Red Dead Online, consider hitting that subscribe button with your bell notifications turned on. This month is completely focused on collectors out there, and also before I mention anything, for those players out there unaware, as a collector your most important tool isn't actually in the game. It's on the internet and it's a collector map that shows you the location of every single collectible updated in real time every single day, and I will leave a link to it in the description below for you to use, as you'll want to reference that as we move forward with this month's update. So moving into it, Rockstar is actually switching things up with how they do things with the free rewards for each week of this event month. Typically, free rewards during each event week of the specific event month have a few different prerequisites before the item you want is automatically unlocked. However, this time around, it's all very simple. So moving into it, your weekly free rewards for assembling and returning each complete weekly collection to the Mystic Madame Nazar. For the week of August 2nd through August 8th, we have the Shoot the Sky emote that you'll get for free. For the week of August 9th through August 15th, you'll receive a pair of Griffith Chaps. For the week of August 16th through the 22nd, you'll receive a pair of range gloves. For the week of August 23rd through August 29th, you'll receive the Eberhart coat. And then August 30th through September 5th, you'll get the Get Over Here emote. And if you're looking for specific locations for each week's weekly collection, make sure to use the Gene Ropke collector map linked in the description below. But moving on to more free rewards and items that we have. Collectors who log in to play Red Dead Online this month will receive the Collector Coin Treasure Map. Meanwhile, reaching a Collector Daily Roll Challenge Streak of 5 will yield a reward for 30% off a Novice or Promising Collector Roll item, and reaching a streak of 10 days will land you a reward for 40% off an Established or Distinguished Collector Roll item. Completing any Collector Free Roam event over the next month will mean you'll receive a Collector Tarot Card Treasure Map, as well as if you collect a Fossil every week during this month, you'll also receive 42 rounds of Buckshot Incendiary Shotgun Ammo, and walking on the other side of the law and completing a Blood Money Opportunity each week this month will result in you receiving eight dynamite arrows. All of these rewards and offers will be delivered within 72 hours of completion to your camp lockbox or post office. Now, this month's featured series game modes. For the first week of the event, we have Hardcore Pro Series 2. For the 9th through the 15th, we have the Bow and Arrow Series. For August 16th through August 22nd, we have Hardcore Gun Rush Teams. For August 23rd through August 29th, we have the Blackwater Series. And then August 30th through September 5th, we have Hardcore Pro Series 3. Moving into the bonuses for this month, we have double money and XP on all collector set sales. Diligence is its own reward for collectors this month, as returning complete sets to Madame Nazar will pay out double the usual Red Dead Online money and XP. Next up, we have double gold, money, and XP on the Ember of the East Opportunity Mission. Set your sights on the mining town of Ansberg, pick your approach, and find a way to steal the Ember of the East before the Flawless Ruby brings Senator Ricard fame at the state's fair. Outlaws will earn double the usual money, gold, and XP for their trouble. After that, we have double gold, money, and XP on all free roam stranger missions. Chaos is running amok on the western frontier, and should you stumble upon strangers or familiar acquaintances on your travels, all free roam missions are paying out double money, gold, and XP all month long. After that, we have double money and XP on the dockside contract. You can break up an illicit smuggling ring stemming from the docks and quays of Saint Denis in the dockside contract, and not only will you earn double money and XP, but you're guaranteed to find more capitale than usual, whether in the pockets of your fallen enemies or stashed in chests scattered throughout the mission. After that, our final Bonus for this month, we have double money and XP on all Land of Opportunity story missions, where you can help widowed Miss Jessica Leclerc avenge the death of her husband in a Land of Opportunities missions this month to rake in double money and XP. If you guys are interested in a gold money and XP guide on any of these bonuses, let me know down in the comments and I can get started on that for you because I think there's actually some pretty good opportunities here. One, obviously collector set sales for making money is going to be the best strategy, but then also using the Opportunity mission as well as the free roam stranger missions to earn double gold really fast and 
easy. Those are also going to be really awesome this month as well. And it's just going to be a nice grind because free roam missions stack really well with Moonshiner and Trader. And while you're keeping up with those businesses, you can keep on collecting for double money with those collector set sales. But moving on, we have to talk about the free community outfit. Some people spend their entire life honing an aesthetic. And this is Juicy Fruit from the r slash Red Dead Fashion subreddit community. Knocked it out of the park on their first ever post. So Rockstar decided to share their look. And you can visit participating local tailors or crack open the Wheeler Ross and Company catalog to pick up the pieces of the stylish ensemble for absolutely free. Starting off, we have a free version of the stalker hat, a free puff tie, a free version of the worsted coat for males or Hartel autumn jacket for females, a free paisley vest, a free everyday shirt for males or a free Iniesta shirtwaist for females, a free cross back set of suspenders, which is just optional if you want to apply it on the outfit or not, a free agency gun belt, free padded saddle work pants and free dress shoes for male characters or free homestead boots if you play as a female character. Now, while you're stocking up on those garments, make sure to check out the Irwin coat and the Woodland gloves as well, because that's limited stock clothing returning to the shelves and catalog just for the month of this event before they start going away again. And it's probably going to be several months and several monthly events before you even see those items spawn back in game. Now that community outfit, just one note, it looks like a Red Dead community funeral outfit, but it was actually made back in December by this is Juicy Fruit, so this was even before the Red Dead funeral was planned, so I'm not really sure if this is, you know, they definitely picked it way back then, and they probably decided to bring it now because it's sort of in theme, right? But it definitely is a diss at the community in a way. But we also have to talk about the discounts. We have 30% off the Navy Revolver, 30% off all collector roll outfits, 30% off all Mustang horses, 35% off the collector saddle bag, 35% off the refined binoculars, 40% off the metal detector, 40% off the Springfield rifle, 40% off the bolt action rifle, 50% off all fence weapons, which include dynamite, fire bottles, hatchets, and tomahawks, and then 50% off all rifle ammunition. Moving into the Prime Gaming Rewards. Players who connect their Rockstar Games Social Club account to Prime Gaming before the date of September 5th will receive five gold bars, an offer for five gold bars off the collector roll, and an outfit for their character, which is either the Reddington for females or the Zakateka for males. And usually we have these Prime Gaming Rewards semi-frequently now with these monthly events where we usually get a new round of bonuses and discounts and basically free items which each, with each monthly event for Prime Gaming members. And just a reminder, you don't need to pay for Prime Gaming to get these rewards because I wouldn't even recommend that anyway. If you already have Amazon Prime though, then you're in luck because Prime Gaming on Twitch is included with that Prime subscription, which by the way, I stream Red Dead Online on Twitch, so you might as well come check out the live streams and hang out with the community if you're a serious Red Dead Online fan. Even if you're not and you're new to the game, Everyone's welcome. Feel free to ask me any questions about the game because I try to be as helpful as possible. But with all that said, that's all we have time for today and we're gonna be wrapping things up right here. I'd love to get your thoughts and opinions on this new August monthly update here in the comments below. Let me know if you love it, if you hate it, some of the things that excite you most, some of the things that you know you dislike most, love to hear it all. But with all that said, hopefully you all enjoyed the video today. And if you did, hopefully I earned your like on it. And of course, if you are new to my channel and you want to stay up to date with all the best Red Dead Online and Rockstar Games content, consider hitting that subscribe button so you don't miss out on a single thing we post here on the channel. We consistently talk about updates, news, information, tips, tricks, and even leaks, and we'll keep you guys updated here on the channel daily. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you'd like to follow me over on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram, those are the best places to get connected with me outside of YouTube, and you're more than welcome to ask me any questions on those platforms. You can follow me at HazardousHDTV, and all of my social media links can be found in the description down below. That being said, thank you all so much for watching, everyone. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you guys in the next Red Dead Online video. Adios, amigos.